another YouTuber called Max Fosh, who you might know as the guy who trolled London Fashion Week with the help of Zach and Jay. Or you might know him as the guy who interviews drunk people in his series Street Smart. Well, recently he purchased a roundabout for no particular reason, to be honest. You know, it's funny, in it? And then even more recently, he released a video called I'm Selling My Roundabout. And we get mentioned in that video. So today we're giving that a watch because there might be a roundabout up for grabs. <laughs> but yeah, just in case you haven't seen his initial video, he bought this roundabout. There's, there's not really much else to it. <laughs> okay, so in Max's first roundabout video, he mentioned he'd be willing to trade the roundabout with Will and E. Because it was made around the same time as Will and E's big trading series that he went nowhere with. Still have my PewDiePie briefcase. So we're going to go ahead and watch his I'm selling my roundabout video because towards the end, that's our bit, okay? Let's let's just skip to the end. Right, so first he chats about Will and E. So let's see what happens here. Here we go. So, now to the selling element of the Swingzen. I did yes. at the towards the end the of the Swingson, video by the say way. that I would like to trade the video for something and I shouted out Mr. William Lenny. And um, it took a while, but he has eventually responded to the video. All right, we've got three reaction cams already. Only the best content on Jack Sucks' stuff. I bought Here we go. About to trade it. I've, I've seen this. I fucking love Max Vosh. He's brilliant. Thank you very much, Will. I kind of feel like I'm third wheeling as one of these little face cams right now. But our bit's coming up. Don't worry. Three and a half grand. And gets a roundabout. I did do that. He, look, he, get, he gets he, he a roundabout and builds a little, a little, a little thing on it. Here we are. <laughs> Welcome. There he is. There I am. To the world. There he is. <laughs> YouTuber roundabout. Pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Well, I've turned subtitles on. Sorry, guys. I got, I got too excited. Can we get to my bit, please, guys? I want to do something with Max in this training. He's not doing anything. He's. <laughs> The last I heard, Will was just way too overwhelmed with like the all the trade stuff. So like my PewDiePie briefcase, he didn't have anything worth trading with me. So he's kind of just put the idea on hold at the minute. I don't think he's really planning on going back into it. This happened on the 9th of January. And I wasn't planning on doing That's this. Bloody video, ages ago, Max. I force Will's hand because a new player has entered the arena. Oh, oh, a new player? Oh. That player is Jack Sucks at Life. That, <clears throat> That's us! <laughs> Max may turn notifications on. Don't be shy. Go on, son. I'm a big fan. He has been doing a Thanks. great series with the play buttons in which he's been trying to get as many plays. Oh, Max, Max, what's going on here? Why are you using old footage? Why are you trying to make me out like I'm some kind of peasant that only has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten play buttons? Max, that's from like seven months ago. We have way more play buttons than that. Now, he made a video also saying that he would be tempted in taking the roundabout off my hands in return for something for me. Oh, oh. suddenly I a big jump. We've got some. All right, this is from which of my subscribers has the most Max subscribers? Max Bosch is subscribed. I am subscribed. He was doing a video of which of my subscribers has the most subscribers. I, I, I told you guys. I told you. Max recently purchased this roundabout, which looks really similar to the roundabout in my GeoGuessr video. He wants really to does. This roundabout with Will and E, but Will and E hasn't said anything yet. He hasn't, Jack. Which is why I feel like you're about to enter the game. <laughs> Max, I would love your roundabout. I'll, I'll tell me what you want. I'll tell you what I want, Jack. Okay, he's about to tell us what he wants. Right, this is exciting. So we could get our hands on a roundabout. I'll have a roundabout. Go on, why not? So what does he you want? You have got a lot of YouTube channels. All with... Did we see you if he subscribed to them? He hasn't subscribed to Don't Subscribe. Obviously, massively offended by that one. Not subscribed to Jack Sucks at Stuff, so he's not going to see this. I do notice he's also not subscribed to Jack Sucks at Life, but he was subscribed in the first screenshot. So I will give him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe he was in incognito mode because it looked tidier or something. But uh, I am going to need to see evidence of you at least subscribe or don't subscribe before we proceed. All with over 100,000 subscribers and you can see in the background of your videos all the lovely plaques that you've got. I've got, I've got quite, quite a lot more than that. Can we can we stop using this footage? You picked a clip where I've got my big lanky arms waving about the place and it's the old camera with the poor quality as well. Not a fan of that clip. Not a fan. The roundabout is in the shape of a YouTube play button. So, <laughs> so obviously I've watched this video already when it came out because, you know, I was excited about it. And before that I was like, yeah, I'll have a roundabout. That'd be nice. But as soon as you he said the roundabout's in the shape of a YouTube play button, which it is. That's a triangle. Play buttons are triangles. Put put it on a play button, Thomas. Now I really want it. <laughs> you know what, Max? It's not even a roundabout. That's at a junction. So although they don't technically have a roundabout in Sillington, I have been offered what is known as a verge for habitat. Verge for habitat, that's what it's called. <laughs> I know that I became the first YouTuber to purchase a verge for habitat isn't as good a title as roundabout, but yeah, technically this patch of grass is called a verge for habitat. I'll have a verge for habitat, to be fair. So if you would like the swings and roundabout for the okay. remainder of the 2021 season, are you going to get your own plaque? We get our own plaque, guys. We get, we get our own plaque. There's room up here, look. I could put a verge for habitat plaque right there. I've come up with this 
separate way to stop that plaque getting stolen. I think his original plaque that he put on the Swingdon, someone stole it after his video, which is so sad. <laughs> I would like to appear on every single one of your YouTube channels, okay? Now, obviously, you've got Jack sucks at Pop-Up Pirate. I'd love to play Pop-Up Pirate with you when we're allowed to. <laughs> Seeing as Will Any is fanning around and taking ages... He really does funny about does Will Any, doesn't he? Jack, what do you say? The offer is very much on the roundabout. It's on the table. You got what I mean. Let's chat. Oh, bloody hell. And then it ends there. Jeez. Look, I'll be up for the swings. And so in order for me to be given the roundabout, the verge for Habitat, he wants to appear on every single channel, which is a bit much. I'm not going to lie. But hey, I can't help notice. Is that Max appearing in which of my subscribers has the most subscribers, which came out on Jack Sucks at Life? There's one ticked at a ding sound effect. Perfect. Whoa. Oh my God. And now he's on Jack Sucks at Stuff. There's another one ticked off the list. Obviously, we've also got Jack Sucks at Clips, but you know, I love putting YouTubers names in titles on that channel. So I'll just take what I've just reacted to and I'll just shove that on there. That, that, that one ticked off as well. So I am interested. Obviously, like, Jack sucks at geography. We could just play GeoGuessr together. That would be so easy. But then some of my other channels, I mean, like, I, I haven't uploaded to Sam Swell's Vaporcod, Sinejo Safk, for like 10 years. Do I want to break that record for a roundabout that I can't actually get to in person? I'm not sure. But either way, let's play Pop Up Pirate together at some point in the future, whether it's in six months or five years. At the very least, even if I don't end up with the play button shaped roundabout, we are playing pop a pirate together and it'll be a lot of fun so what i want to do at this point is i want to come to you guys because i'm not sure i want to buy his roundabout but you might have heard i am doing a challenge with mr beast at the moment where we're trying to get a channel with no videos to a million subscribers right now the channel's on 750,000, and the forfeit that i have to complete when it hits the 800k is i have to buy a billboard i don't know what exactly is going on with billboards at the minute because obviously people aren't really in town centers and stuff that much i visualize like loads of my audience going to the town where the billboard is and taking pictures in front of it, which isn't something I really want to encourage at the moment. So I was kind of thinking, as a placeholder until I can do that, what if we sublet Max's roundabout from him and we get him to put a big banner promoting don't subscribe on his roundabout? And then when we can do the billboard thing properly, we do the billboard thing as well. That could just be kind of funny, you know? But obviously Max is going to want something in return for that. So in the comments down below, please let me know what should we offer Max Fosh in exchange for sponsoring his roundabout. <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> so yeah, just a little reaction video for now. I will leave it with you guys. What can we give Max in exchange for this big banner on the roundabout? I think that'll be a lot of fun. So thank you so much for watching. Max's channel and original video will be in the description. Go ahead and subscribe. Of course, subscribe to Jack Sucks and Stuff if you've not already. And I will see you later. <laughs>